Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So this video is going to be a tutorial using the new um, Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette. So I'm going to start by priming my eyes with the MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot as usual. And I'm going to leave all the products and brushes used below so you know exactly which ones I used and how to get to them. And then I'll be using the Modern Renaissance Palette here. I'm loving it. Love these shades. So I'm going to take my Sigma E40 blending brush and I'm going to take the shade Tempera to set the MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot. So it's just a matte white shade. And then I'm going to go back into the palette and take the shade Burnt Orange and using the same brush I'm going to apply that into the crease. So then I'm taking the shade Raw Sienna and putting that into the crease as well. I'm just building up these darker shades to deepen the crease. This is something I do very often. And then using the brush in the palette, I'm taking the blending side and I'm using the shade Real Gar. It's like the most gorgeous um, orange shade ever. I love this color. And then I'm taking this Morphe brush. I'll leave the name down below. And I'm taking the shade Red Ochre. It's a really pretty burgundy shade. And I'm applying that into, into the outer corner and the crease as well but focused more on the outer corner as you see here and then I'm just blending everything out. So now I'm taking a smaller brush, um, this is by Sigma, and then I'm taking the shade Cypress Umber and I'm applying that um, into the outer corner building up the shade because it is really dark and I'm applying it then into the crease, kind of creating almost like a cut crease. Cracky. So now I'm taking the other side of the brush in the palette and I'm taking the shade Tempera and I'm applying this into the inner corner and the middle part of the lid and I'm bringing it up higher to cut the crease just a little bit. Then using my Sigma E15 shader brush, I'm going to take the shade Primavera, the most gorgeous golden shade ever, like a little bit champagne-y, and I'm applying this right over the Tempera shade to bring a little bit shimmer, and this works so well with the reddish shade it's in the palette, it's just beautiful, and then I'm kind of blending the two um, shades together so that they blend nicely. And then using this really small elf brush, I'm going to take the shade Cypress Umber just to cut the crease a little bit more and define that line. So now I'm taking my Inglot 77 gel liner and the Sigma angled brush and I'm just using this to create a wing. So moving on to the face, I'm going to prime my face using the Smashbox Pore Minimizing Primer. And for foundation, I'm using the Makeup Forever Stick Foundation. And I'm using this brush. It is by the brand My Makeup Brush. And this is the oval set. And I'm using this for my foundation. I'll have the link below because I do have a coupon code with them. It's Save with Rotem and that gives you money off. So you can check that out in the description box. I'll have the link and everything over there. So now for a little bit of a cream contour, I'm using the um, Benefit Do The Hula. And I'm using this brush from the Oval My Makeup Brush Set. And it comes off a little bit cool tone, but then it becomes more natural to fit your skin tone. And then I'm using the Urban Decay Naked Concealer to highlight my face. And I'm just going to blend this out with a Morphe brush. So now to bake, I'm using my Laura Mercier Translucent Powder and the Sigma F35 brush. And I'm just baking under my eyes, on my chin, smile lines, forehead. And then filling my eyebrows very quickly with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer in the shade Ebony. And for mascara, I'm using the Smashbox Full Exposure Mascara. So for the glow, I'm using my Anastasia Glow Kit in Sun Dipped and my favorite M501 brush by Morphe. And I'm just applying this to the tops of my cheekbones and the bridge of my nose, the tip of my nose. And to finish my eyes, I'm using the Sigma Pencil Brush and the Real Gar shade. And then I'm blending the Cypress Umber shade with that on the lower lash line so it's smoked out. 
and then using the same Sigma pencil brush, just a different one, I'm using the shade Vermeer for an inner corner highlight. And then applying black eyeliner and mascara to the lower lashes. And for the lips, I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick in the shade um, Ashton. And that's it for this look. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.